Welcome, everyone, to a journey beyond your wildest imagination. Today, we delve into the mysterious and thrilling lore of the Chupacabra. Tales of this elusive creature have fascinated and terrified people across the globe. But what is the Chupacabra? Where did it come from? And what makes it one of the most captivating mysteries of our time? These terrifying accounts have turned the Chupacabra into a modern-day legend, a fearsome predator who leaves a trail of death and destruction in its wake. But where did this legend begin? Originally, owners of the victims thought the Chupacabra to be a half-human, half-vampire beast. Stories around the original Chupacabra began in newspapers dating back to the 1950s. In fact, the first reported case in North America was in Arizona sometime around 1956, which means this heavy creature has been on the radar of cryptozoologists or scientists who study animals that may or may not be real in North and South America for nearly 70 years. People tell of the chupacabra's glowing red eyes and glistening fangs, and of how the beast lurks in the forest, preying on goats and cattle, terrifying local residents. Chupacabra means goat sucker in Spanish, and according to reports, the creature acts much like a vampire killing animals by sucking their blood. Though similar stories date back several decades, the first major wave of alleged chupacabra sightings came from farmers in Puerto Rico in the late 1980s and early 1990s. Some accounts detail incidents where hundreds of animals were massacred at once, including goats, chickens, ducks, and dogs, indicating the chupacabra's voracious appetite for diverse prey. Today, people across much of Latin America and the southwestern United States tell tales of the chupacabra. Descriptions of the creature vary, but one thing remains consistent. The chupacabra is a formidable force to be reckoned with. The chupacabra is believed to be a bipedal creature, standing about three to four feet tall. It has spiky quills along its back, sharp claws, and an insatiable thirst for blood. In some legends, the chupacabra is said to have the ability to shape-shift or hypnotize its victims. It's truly a creature of the night, lurking in the shadows, waiting for the perfect moment to strike. Chupacabras are said to attack farm animals and drain their blood. Some witnesses even report finding animal bodies that look like they were cut open with a knife. As it turns out, however, these events aren't necessarily so strange. Disease and infection can kill seemingly healthy animals, and some insects drink blood from fresh corpses. When animals die, gases in their bodies can expand, splitting them open with seemingly surgical precision. Reports from Puerto Rico started around 1975, following the brutal killings of numerous farm animals in the small town of Mocha. It gained notorious prominence in the 1990s as the attacks escalated in both occurrence and magnitude and was called El Vampiro de Mocha, or the, the Vampire of Mocha. Many trace the tale back to a Puerto Rican woman named Maidline Tolentino, whose description of the creature seen outside of her window in San Juan in 1995 became the basis for most other accounts of the cryptid. Recent reports include a sighting in 2022 when a perplexing object was recorded by security cameras at the Amarillo Zoo in Texas, prompting the city to seek public assistance in identifying it. The unusual image was captured around 1.25 a.m. on May 21 within the zoo's perimeter fence. The city is left wondering whether the entity was a nocturnal individual wearing a mask, a large coyote standing on its hind legs, or possibly a chupacabra, leaving the identification of this mysterious figure for the residents of Amarillo to resolve. And in 2023, when a cryptic entity has been reportedly observed in Bolivia, coinciding with instances of livestock found lifeless, seemingly drained of blood, leading to heightened concerns of a legendary demon wreaking havoc in the vicinity, the eerie drone footage captured near Ori City reveals a shadowy figure wandering through a field. This enigmatic appearance aligns with the demise of multiple cows, llamas, and alpacas in the region, their unique neck injuries prompting local speculation of an attack by a chupacabra. Driven by a relentless fascination, investigators and enthusiasts have dedicated their lives to unraveling the truth behind the chupacabra. But despite countless expeditions and scientific studies, the chupacabra remains shrouded in mystery. Is the chupacabra a mere figment of our imagination? Or does it lurk in the depths of our reality, waiting to be discovered? The answers lie within the unknown. As we conclude our journey into the captivating lore of the chupacabra, one thing becomes clear. A world without mysteries would be a world devoid of wonder. The chupacabra reminds us to embrace the unexplained, to keep exploring, and never lose sight of the hidden magic that surrounds us.
Exploring and exploring, from exploring, get to subscribe and ring the bell to stay updated on our latest videos. If you enjoyed this delve into the mysterious realm of folklore, hit that like button and share your thoughts in the comments section down below. Until next time, stay curious, stay brave, and keep on exploring.